Welcome everybody, I'm Jake, this is Cobra Sport and today I'm introducing you to our new exhaust talk series and what we're going to be doing is answering your questions on everything about our exhausts. Let's go. So a common question we get asked here at Cobra Sport quite often, what is the difference between your resonated and non-resonated exhausts? And there's one easy answer, sound. Crank up your speakers, take a listen. So, to explain that difference in sound, a resonated system will have a centre section that looks a bit like this. Rather than a straight pipe through the middle, we've got a resonator, which is effectively a small silencer. In that silencer, you have perforated tubing, which allows the exhaust gases to pass through. They're then going to get dampened out by this wire wool and e-glass that we have inside of the resonator wall. And this is your non-resonated section, which sometimes produces different tones. And the tones you prefer all depend on your preferences. As you'll have seen from the sound clip, the non-resonated system produces a much more raw sound. The emotions there, the frequencies are there, and it really does give you that feeling. A resonated system on certain engines can be just as layery, but essentially it tones things down a little bit makes it a little bit easier for daily driving, daily living and not waking Brenda up next door first thing on the morning. The main aim is to make the resonated system a nice, subtle, sporty upgrade from the stock exhaust system that's already on your car. The non-resonated system is a bit more for the thrill seeker, the person who wants to be able to punch out and really make a sound and stand out from the crowd. So that brings us on to another question. Which one's best for me? Essentially we don't know. The best thing to do is do your research. If you have a look on our YouTube, look at your car and the sound it makes with resonated and non-resonated exhausts, you can get a good idea for the feel of it. Obviously, trying to play this through your laptop, mobile phone, it's not gonna have the right effect. Do use some speakers or a good set of headphones and you'll really experience the audible emotion that you can get from Cobra Sport System. Another popular question, why is the resonated system more expensive than the non-resonated system? And the simple answer is cost and labour. As we've shown, this is your non-resonated pipe. As you can see, still a bit of pipe, there isn't much to us producing that. Again, the resonator has that same pipe with a silencer, more steel, two types of packing, perforated tube, and the labour to make it. So that's why it's more expensive. Is there a difference in performance? Not really. The difference in a resonated and non-resonated system in terms of brake horsepower, foot-pounds of torque or newton meters, however you look at these figures, is very negligible. The main difference between the resonator and the non-resonated system is silencing and the tone it produces. So that pretty much wraps up today's episode of Exhaust Talk. And remember, if you've got a topic that you want covering, leave a comment below and we might be able to get round to your questions next time on Exhaust Talk. Thanks for tuning in.